Hey guys, Mimi Nandia here, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna go and um, see what Pudge's house looks like, and then after that, I will be giving you a tour of my fish exhibit part of my museum. Let's get to it. Yeah, I'm not going to be participating in the bug off this year. Probably not. Alright, so here I am. Got my nice little summer outfit. Got a layered tank that's uh, green, a green flashy hairpin. Uh, panda backpack come with me. Some denim shorts that are white and some uh, rubber toe sneakers that are green. And my black square glasses. Boys. I actually need to remember which uh, house where Pudge's house is. Okay. Yeah, the ones with the long locust. I'm not gonna catch them. They're kind of really difficult to catch sometimes. Yep, I just have. Let's go. So if we kind of remember from last time I filmed, uh, Ty Bolt actually moved out. But this is Pudge's room. Pudge's home. So here he has, he is sporting the elephant slide here, the train set, a rocking horse, a baby chair, um, a few of these um, wooden block accessories that include the stereo, the wardrobe, a wooden block, uh, excuse me, I'm still not awake yet, I haven't had my coffee, <laughs> but this is the wooden block bed and some shelves back here. But yeah, he's a cute little bear. I like his um, designs, his home interior. So uh, let's get over to my museum and I'll show you the fish exhibit. Alright, so welcome to my museum. Basically the museum lobby is the same like everyone else is on their island. And obviously it is morning time, so Blather's here is very tired so he is going to actually sleep until 6 p.m. every time every day let's go to the fish exhibit shall we alright so right here is um, the main fish exhibit that we go into uh, all of these are actually um, uh, fresh water fish so let me try to find a uh, sign I say this because I actually don't have my glasses on at the moment
fish. Yep. Cool. Anytime I catch a new type of fish or a new type of bug, it gets automatically uh, delivered to blathers. Alright, so this is actually really cool, but this is considered the uh, sea life and also... Um, actually, no, I think this is the sea life area because over here is where you would go to the uh, darker depths of the ocean fish. That's pretty big, ain't it? How'd you catch that thing? A lot of patience and try not to scare it away. Cool. So, this is some of the ocean fish that I've caught. I can't see anything right now. Alright, so this is uh, considered the deep depths of the ocean. Here, there's a submarine, there's a submarine suit, which I did not donate that at all. But here's my fish. I'm gonna go this way, why not? Peek a boo! <laughs> gonna go this way! Oh, yeah, I haven't caught that fish yet. <laughs> We're gonna go down this way, actually. So this is just some more uh, fish that I've caught that are from the sea. It's pretty cool. Plus uh, some fish, uh, some actual sea life that you catch when you go uh, deep sea diving, actually. Mm-hmm. These are actually some stuff that I've caught um, while deep sea diving. And I think that's what this whole tank mostly consists of. Oh, no, I was wrong. The umbrella octopus are very hard to catch. They're very, very fast. through another wall. I'm gonna see if I can find another entryway. Nope, actually that was it. So I guess that concludes my small tour of my museum. I thought there was more to it but I guess that was all the rooms in the fish exhibit. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, small video. I've got many more fish to catch. 
but I kind of have to wait until the next month to see what swims around in the oceans, rivers, streams, ponds. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching guys, and I hope you guys have a good day.